today with the Erin Condren Summer Surprise Box. It just came in the mail today and I haven't opened it except to um, undo this tape right here. And I had to do a weird thing to get my camera high enough to even see most of the box because my usual setup is like much closer. And this box is much bigger than I expected it. So this is the box that came with my Erin Condren planner in it. And as you can see, this box, uh, maybe you can't see, is quite a bit thicker than it, and it's also bigger and wider. Uh, and so that was a surprise. I've never ordered one of these boxes before. I actually ordered this box before I decided to get an Erin Condren planner. I thought that the summer surprise box would be a fun way to get kind of like a random assortment of Erin Condren items to just try out the brand before deciding if I wanted a planner. And then the more I looked at it, um, the more I was like, yeah, I actually do just want to get the planner. Um, but I have this box and I'm going to unwrap it and we're going to see what's in it. I did see the spoiler on the Erin Condren website. So I have an idea of at least one thing that's in here. And then I apologize for any shakiness. My table is inherently a little shaky, and that's more obvious with this weird setup I had to do to get the box in the frame, but I'll try to minimize that. So this is what you see when you open it, and the box theme is Hello Sunshine, and it says, let the box unboxing begin. If this is your first box, welcome to the party. Oh, it's my first box. Um, if you joined us for past surprise boxes we're so glad you're back the seasonal box is chock full of hand-picked items that celebrate the happy sunshine of the summer from exclusives to sneak peeks we're so excited about the stunning assortment that is perfect for ushering in the new season and so there's just this informational thingamajigger about their hashtag Ooh, and then content i don't want to look at those yet okay let's go to this side because there's like a little pocket thing and this is so wonderful. I was just thinking earlier today that I needed to get a cup like this. Oh my god. So I drink a lot. I drink like a cup of iced coffee every morning. And right now I carry it um, in this little like cactus um, cup. But it's so hard to clean, and I never clean it right, and I can always tell if I didn't quite clean it right, because then my coffee starts to taste weird, and I have to go in and try to clean it again, and it's so hard to clean because the little cactus arms, like, it's hard to get in there. Um, and I only have, like, one or two cups, because I don't need, like, a ton of cups. Um, I only buy, like, a new cup if I, like, need a particular purpose, and so, um... This is actually really fun because I was going to go out and buy another plastic tumbler that I could use for my iced coffee that would also be easier to clean than that weirdly shaped cactus. And so here you have it. Um, and this is so much fun. It's so cute. It's blue. It has this pink straw and the Erin Condren symbol. Oh, this is fun. This is so such a coincidence. Um, and I just realized that I completely forgot to show the um, lid of the box. Be a pineapple, stand tall, wear a crown, and be sweet on the inside. So, that's fun. Um, I've heard people talk about, like, people save the boxes for these sayings. Um, I like it. I may actually just cut the saying off of the box. Continuing on inside. Let's see. So this is what was in the spoiler and um, I knew it would be in here and this is fun because I actually have a pair of prescription sunglasses right here and this is just the ugly case that came with them when I went to go pick them up earlier this year that the um, like optometrist just gave me so my glasses would be protected. Um, and so now I have this and it's really cute it's blue it says hello sunshine and it comes with a little eyeglass thing in those mid-century circle 
that mid-century circle pattern and it's so great my glasses are always a little smudgy i don't have one of these microfiber cloths um as someone who wears glasses every single day because i need them to like see at all like i don't just have reading glasses i need them to do everyday things i don't know why i don't have a microfiber cloth but now i do so so far i'm really liking the box Erin Condren has provided me with two items that I already needed. Um, and that's just really a happy coincidence. Next, we have these dual tip markers in these bright fluorescent colors, um, which is a lot of fun. In a bit, at the end, I'll go through and see which um, items are sneak peeks, which are exclusive, and things like that. Because um, like, I haven't seen these in the store. And they're this bright fluorescent color. I don't use a lot of bright fluorescents, um, but I'm sure I can get some use out of these. They're definitely pretty. Then, elastic band hair ties. I use hair ties, but I've never used any like these, this like knot thing. Um, so these, that's interesting. I like this pattern. I like how Erin Condren um, implements their like patterns in lots of their products because it's like it's like iconic and I like that. Um, and then you have the um, logo and then just a more generic white band. And I guess they work like any other elastic. I don't want to take them off the thing right now, but hmm. that's kind of cute. I don't know. I don't know what I'll use them for in theory tying up my hair but right now I use like really plain um one second like I use hair ties like this um so that's different I like this just feels a lot sturdier than those seem but we'll see how they go next we have a sticker sheet that is in, foiled in like this holographic kind of foil oh there are multiple sticker sheets. There is at least two. So let's check it out. Okay, here we go. So we have these cool, like, general summer deco um, sticker sheet with a lot of different little summary items, flip flops. That tumbler is here too. Sunglasses. A pineapple. That's um, like on the box. Hello sunshine. So you can definitely see the theme throughout the box. And then this is a more functional sheet. That is summer colored. Um, but definitely a little more general. And also foiled. So that's nice. Ooh, it's a pineapple notepad. Oops. Um, so I don't know what I use this for. I don't use like notepads, um, just in general. I use small sticky notes on occasion. And um, but this is like a large notepad. And right now, just off the top of my head, I can see myself using this as like. A background in my bullet journal or to maybe like letter a quote and hang up somewhere I don't know but it is pretty if nothing else it's nice to look at so I like that and then there is a notebook and so this is the last the last of the, the last thing in the box it's gold foiled. It has a pineapple on it. It says, Jot your thought includes 80 lined pages. Erin <sighs> Condren. Again, I was just thinking that I wanted a notebook. Um, I was just thinking that I wanted another notebook. I have a few different project ideas. And now I have another notebook. Um, so it has 80 lined pages. This inside part for information 
and then that little symbol up there and those are all the same color it smells nice it's got that nice new notebook smell and it has a sewn binding which those usually lay flat um, at the very least it won't be hard to write against like it's not a coil so this is also quite nice I was worried about getting the surprise box and it only being stuff applicable to like their planners um, like I know sometimes they in past boxes they've given another cover or sticker sheets for like um, monthly sticker sheets and things like that but this box is actually really nice because this is just a new notebook um, let's actually look at everything this is just a general notebook this is a fun notepad. You have two sticker sheets. These can be really, I mean, you can use those in any planner. That's a decorative sheet. If you have hair, you can use hair bands. And you can use those to tie up anything else. Um, most people have sunglasses if they don't have glasses, um, prescription glasses. Um, bright markers, anyone can use a marker. A fun cup. Um, did I cover everything? Yes, I did. And so, it's really nice. There are... So there are like seven different things. Um, and the box, I believe, was $35. I think I'm forgetting the exact amount, but I'm pretty sure. And so that's nice because it's like, on average, $5 a thing. But we know that most of these things are worth well more than that. Um, so like the sticker sheets, I probably wouldn't pay five dollars for those, but this notebook is definitely worth that much. The tumbler is probably worth a little more. The um, eyeglasses um, holder is about that much. So you definitely, I'm happy. I think I got my money's worth. I liked the surprise. Um, so that's like an extra thing that's like worth some um, hard to quantify amount of money. And as we can see here, a lot of these things are actually exclusives. So the sticker pack is this two sheet sticker pack is exclusive to the box. The tumbler is a sneak peek, so that will be coming out later on their website. The sunglass case is exclusive. This thought ah, this jot your thought journal is exclusive. The markers are a sneak peek. The pineapple notepad is exclusive, and the elastic hair ties are exclusive. So there are actually a lot of things that you only get in this um, box. And then also some things that will come out later. So this is a really nice cup. I really like it. And it's a $10 value. And it's set to come out eventually. Um, but I don't think I would have actually, I don't know that I would actually have bought this um, I would have probably thought to go to like um, my local Walmart or something when I realized that I needed such a cup. But I actually really like this cup and so I'm really glad that I got this box. <laughs> and I I like it. I'm happy with this um, surprise box and I think that I'm definitely looking forward to the fall one. And I'm excited to see what I'll do with these um, fun new toys that I got. So. Yeah, I'm really interested to know what you think of the Summer Surprise Box. Um, and just comments in general. And if you like this video, please be sure to like and subscribe to my channel if you want more. Um, I hope that I have enough videos now that you get a general idea of what my channel is. Planning, bullet journaling, me buying random things to look at and also show you and try out. And so yeah. If you like that kind of stuff, I hope you'll come back, and thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye!